Hi, today we are going to learn how to charge users to register to your WordPress site. CM registration allows your users to log in and register to your site via beautiful pop-ups. The Pro Payments add-on lets you charge users for registering. In this example use case guide, we'll cover how to allow users to add payments to your registration process. We consider that you have already bought the CM registration plugin and the payments add-on and installed them. You also need to install one of the payment plugins, either Easy Digital Downloads or WooCommerce. As far as the payment add-on is concerned, there is almost no difference between using either EDD or WooCommerce. Both are free and provide free and paid add-ons. Don't forget to configure the payment plugin. This way you can connect it to payment providers such as PayPal or credit card companies. Be sure that your payment plugin has the correct checkout and card pages set up. They are used by the plugin. Users who wish to register will have to complete a payment through the chosen payment system. This is the most important part of the process and it's quite straightforward. We start by creating price options, one or more. To do so, navigate to CM Registration Pro, Settings, Payments tab. Start by selecting the payment provider. Note that EDD or WooCommerce has to be activated to show up on the list. First way, you can choose custom payment URL option and then add a URL to the relevant field. URL should be absolute path such as example that you can see on the screen. Custom payment URL means you are able to use the third-party payment plugin and after user pays, admin need to approve user manually from the user section. Another way to charge for registering is to choose EDD or WooCommerce. You can set the products associated with the payment. For each you can set an assigned product, an assigned user role for new members, this field is optional, background color and text color. You can create the products in advance or you can quickly create them for either services by clicking the button create new product. You can set different prices to allow users to pay for different user roles. For instance, $5 for customer, $10 for subscriber and $15 for editor. We'll explain further how to show these differences to users. Once the user chooses to register, they will be redirected to checkout. The account is already created but not activated yet. It will be activated after the payment. There are two ways to show payment options when you have more than one. First way – displaying the package table. Use the CMREC packages shortcode on any post or page to display all payment options. Where does the data comes from? The shortcode displays data from the products such as title and description. You can see on the screen example from EDD. Second way – displaying on the registration form. The package options will be displayed automatically on the registration form under the membership plan drop-down. Back in the Payments tab, you can configure the payment reminder and auto-deletion of inactive user accounts that didn't pay during defined by you period of time. You need to input the number of days in these fields or put zero to disable these features. The payment reminder message will be sent every set number of days to users who registered but didn't pay. You can customize this message in the Email tab, the template called Payment Reminder. You can use HTML and shortcodes to add dynamic content to the email. The payment set down adds three extra labels which can be customized. To configure them, navigate to the Labels tab. Scroll down and under the Payments section you will see the relevant labels. You can also enable recurring payments. They are handled by the payment plugins, EDD or WooCommerce. Once that is configured, accounts will be paused as soon as the description is cancelled. You can learn more how subscriptions work in EDD and WooCommerce in their official documentation. Following instructions found in the plugin and guides, you should be able to charge your users for registering. Thanks for watching the video. 